has been absolutely ridiculous in the faceoff circle for Union. He won a few in a row, including a fantastic kick faceoff win that led to the tying goal against Harvard last weekend. Yeah, he's had 66%. That's an unreal percentage in the circle. Union College moving the puck well in the circle. They've got Quinnipiac moving. Shot score! Spencer Foo! Long pass right side, rolled in off the stick of Clifton. Clifton is, goes in the corner. And is still out there. Everybody else changed up for Quinnipiac. Pass up to the right point. Kept alive. Now to the center of the blue line. Over to Annis. Fires the wrister. Scores. Wrister picked his, uh, Annis picked his spot. And up as he crosses the Union blue line. No call. Union with a four on three through center ice. Dropped to the point. Sent towards the net looking for a deflection. Puck bounces away. Great job by Federico. He was on his keister and he made a block. But now another breakaway for Smith. Fires and misses the net. No, it goes in. What? Minute 45, left of the power play, long lead pass for Timpani. He's got Vecchioni. Vecchioni just can't catch up to the saucer pass. Now it comes to Fu, right wing circle, pass to the left side, shot, scores! Jeff Taylor on the power play for tied at two. 20 seconds left in the power play. Here's Annis again. Annis cuts to the slot. Right wing circle now, drops it, fires, save, rebound, scores! Landon, uh, excuse me, it's Tim Clifton who picks up the loose change and buries it. And a power play goal for the Bobcats with 10.37 to go. Has them up 3-2. to two. Evernur denied by Sakelaropoulos. Who delivers another hit over on the far side. Wilkins gets away from his man. This is a 3-on-2 for Union. Wilkins gets around. Looking for Novak. Wilkins puck in front. Scores! Max Novak ties the game at 3. Final minute of play here. 3-on-3 three three through center. Here comes Annis. Peeds St. Dennis. Moves in front. Back in. Scores! St. Dennis takes the feed, cuts across the paint, and puts the backhander in behind Sakelaropoulos. And it's 4-3 Bobcats, their third power play goal of the night with 51.7 to go. Well, we talk about that top line, but don't forget Travis St. Dennis, the junior, with a great individual effort. You know, Wilkins was caught deep in Quinnipiac's zone, but it looked like Union was okay. It was a three-on-three -three rush. And Wilkins, I thought, maybe should have gone to the bench for a change. It didn't really matter. Uh, St. Dennis put on the Jets on the left wing, cut in front. And I think Sakelaropoulos thought that St. Dennis was going to move across the goal now. So he started moving to his left. St. Dennis quickly tucked it in on the near post. And what a costly penalty for Scarfo. 4-3 Quinnipiac late. 3-4 for four tonight on the power play. The only positive of all that is that there's still lots of 40 seconds left. So and Quinnipiac scored early in the power play. Taylor knocked off the play. So Kelleropoulos goes to the bench. Champion of the shot. Save made a big rebound. Union's net is empty. Henry flips it towards the net. Deflection goes wide. Union trying to tie things up with the extra attacker like they did against Harvard. Puck at the half wall left side. Quinnipiac battling. 22 seconds remaining. Puck underneath a player. Union gets it free. Up top, Henry with a bomb. Stick save by Gartig up and out of play with 14.8 ticks on the clock. And a good play by the captain, Federico. As there was a scrum on the left side, or at least a Gartig's right. And all of a sudden, the puck popped loose, and it was going cross ice. The only guy there was Champini for a split second. So the stick on the ice, reading the play all the way, it was Federico. He was able to move it back to the blue line, and Henry took the shot. Obviously now, critical faceoff here, Vecchioni to take it for Union. Fu, Champini, and Taylor all to the right side. Face off. Whoa. Went right towards the net and almost hopped in. Yeah, Garte got to put a stick on it. And this is going to roll towards the empty net. It's going to go wide. Should be icing with just five seconds. No, they're yeah, going to wave, wave off. icing off. Good and that will off. do it. Three yep. seconds. Shot up, deflected, and the horn blows. And the Kuripiap Gobcats fell behind 1-0, but they took the lead three more times in this game. And they have downed the Dutchman by a final score of 4-3. to three.